So my monumental ceramics are definitely inspired from my childhood place. Um, where I spend most of my childhood at my grandparents in the Bavianskloof. I look back at the Bavianskloof as a safe, supporting community, a sense of home and a sense of belonging. And how we envision these forms holding emotions, you know, with its experiences, with its emotions, and then also that one figure within a family, within a community that makes a change. I express my storytelling through the making of these morphic abstract dwellings. The storytelling touch on memory as a narrative and I also look at it from the sense of where I'm currently situated in my career, where I'm working and the engagement from other people. It's basically a few environments being combined into one that's telling my story. The ideas for my forms are mostly influenced by architecture. Architecture can be seen as an ancient way of protecting your family, a location, and it's also where you see yourself. When I look at my forms, I, I, I look at the surroundings, what home means, where I came from, the build up. I allow my forms to breathe by cutting into them. So there's a, a, a channel, a space, a passage for the viewer, for the form to breathe. A lot of it stems from the complexities within a family, within a home, and sometimes you need those quiet spaces to yourself. So that's how I go about the form um, and constructing them. I ideally not pre-plan the colours. Each of these forms are very much individual. If the form requires uh, a lighter colour, then it means that it's a lighter mood, it's a lighter setting, and there's a different connotation to it. So I think all of the final works uh, comes from the form, what it communicates to me. The most challenging part throughout my creative journey, process, making process, is opening a kiln and finding a hairline crack with, that you did not see coming. That completely just ruins you because you have this pre-expectation of what your work would look like and the kiln gods just swing the other way. Home is safety, home is protection, home is community, home is love, home is more than physical, home is spiritual and home is belonging. That is home for me. <laughs>